Ruining Lives a Youth at a Time by Kara David. Can you imagine how many people die per day because of alcohol or illegal substances? What about how many families get ripped apart because of this? All because of a substance that makes a person feel something they cannot feel without it. This presentation will cover the effects on the body, family, and how to get help. Effects on the body. Alcoholism, cancer of the mouth, throat, esophagus, liver, colon, and breast. Cirrhosis, which is among the 15 leading causes of all deaths in the United States. This was from the CDC. Birth defects. This increases the risk of miscarriage, stillbirth, and fetal alcohol spectrum disorders. This was also from the CDC. Abnormalities seen in one-third of infants of women who drank heavily during their pregnancy. This was from the PCRM. Effects on the body, drug addiction. Permanent damage to the heart and brain, heart attacks, strokes, lung damage, and death. Heroin was involved in four of every five drug-related deaths in Europe. This was from the drug-free world. Drug addiction birth defects. Miscarriage, low birth weight, premature labor, placental abruption, fetal death, and maternal death. Babies exposed to cocaine late in pregnancy may be born dependent. This causes suffering from withdrawal symptoms such as tremors, sleeplessness, muscle spasms, and feeding difficulties. This was from the American Pregnancy Association. Effects on the family. The families get torn apart, become distanced with the addicted person, and Hammond talks in his book about how my family wasn't speaking to me. Hammond 3. Effects on the family. Effects on the children. Studies have shown that alcohol is a leading factor in child maltreatment and neglect cases. This was from the CDC. More likely to have poor, poor physical, intellectual, social, and emotional outcomes. This was from the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. They also have a greater risk of developing substance abuse problems themselves. This was from the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services also. How to get help. You can go to rehab or therapy, and to get off your addiction, the person has to know and realize that they have a problem and want to change. That's the biggest part about it. Then they have to enter into a facility to get help. They can also have family support, which can help with job and money, and it can also help them get into a facility. In conclusion, alcoholism and drug addiction takes over lives every day. It can ruin bodies and families. Good thing is, there are always ways to get help. The reason why I can relate to this is because I've had family members in my family that have had drug addiction and definitely alcohol.